Hey everybody. So last week we did, uh, we did, uh, well I built this little doohickey here. And um, my friend, I told my friend about it and I told him that I was really impressed with how it worked on drums. And so he said, he said you should try it on bass. And so I thought, okay, well, yeah, that, that's a good idea. My, uh, my wife uh, decided to go have a girls' night at, at her friend's that lives on the beach. And so I had a chance to actually record, like, with an amp and stuff again, which was kind of nice. It's been a while. Ever since COVID started, it really hasn't happened because of, well, because of COVID. And so she, she said, oh. So I thought, you know what, I'll give it a shot. Um, if you didn't see the original one of these, I will put the link. Well, it'll be there. I think that's where it usually goes is there. I'll do that. And um, and uh, so, yeah, that one. So pretty much all this is, is this is, this is what a sub-frequency microphone is. It's a speaker in a case. And it, in my case, it goes to a quarter inch, not an XLR, because I don't know how to wire up an XLR yet. That'll probably be another video to do that. So, so what I did was, I'll show a picture of that too. I I put I put my a pile microphone, one of my overhead, my drum overhead mics, I'm trying different microphones on on the amps because I want to see if I can get a different sound. Instead of always using the SM57, let's see what else we can do. So I put that on the amp, like I did put where the where the um, the dust cover, the cone meets the magnet, the dust cover spot right there. That's where you generally put it. And then I put I put this thing down below, so it was picking up the lower end. And the reason why the reason why I did this was because I wanted. Because I'm doing Fred is dead. Fred is dead needs the the pick, the noise of the pick more. So it needs a little bit more of the high from the bass than the low, because it's just the the way the song is really. And so that's that's what I did. So let's uh, let's go look on the system here. All right. So now I got on Jog. So that's the waveform for the um, for the overhead mic. So that's that's the condenser mic. This is the waveform for the sub frequencies. And now I've blended them both together to make this right now. I don't know if I'm gonna keep it or not, but this is this is what, what I'm doing. So I'm gonna play for you first. I'm gonna play for you just just the um, the um, the high mic. All right, so that's that's what the high mic sounds like. Now we'll switch to the subwoofer. So I don't know I don't know how well this is going to sound on YouTube. Um, maybe put some headphones on, but you can really hear there is there's a low end. It's picking up the low end quite well. So now these are both together. So the high and the low. Nothing, nothing mixed. So that's, that's what I've got there. So I'm going to mute those out and now we'll play. This is, this is what I blended it as. Like I said, it's, it's not a final. It's just how I'm going to, I'm listening to it right now. All right, so now what else I did, now I played it for you first, so we'll go to track five. You see I have, I have, I've, on track five, which is the, the overhead, I took the low end out. Now right now it's not on, I'm going to turn it on, now it's on. So now I've turned the EQ on that one. Let's go to track six. Same thing, we turn the EQ on. And on this one, as you can see, I took all the high end out. So now I've turned on the EQ on both to blend them together. So now we'll do this. We'll do the test again. We will start with track five, or with uh, we will start with the overhead. 
So the high end. All right, now let's switch over. Now both. So that's, that's what I did. So I brought out, on the lower one, I brought out the high end. Or I'm, on the lower one, I cut out the high end and I brought out the low end. And on the, on the, on the high end one, I just, I cut out the high end, brought out the low end. Or brought out the high end, cut out the low end. I am confusing you. So, it was a test. Um, it, it, it was interesting. I don't know if I'll do it again. Uh... That's what it, that's what I did for this one. Um, yeah, so that's about it today. So like and subscribe, and I will talk to you later. Bye.